Welcome back. In this video, I'll teach you everything that you need to know about Torset's Dupois. This condition is very important for exams and you will see it everywhere. There are many different conditions that can cause this pattern, but mainly medication overdose, especially antiarrhythmic medications. In the ECG, you will see twisting of points, which we will see right now. Essentially, there will be a couple of waves that are contracted together, followed by a few waves that are separated apart, and then another waves that are contracted together. So every few consecutive waves of QRS complexes will be either contracted together or separated apart. The most common cause of this condition is prolongation of QT interval. This interval can be prolongated by manipulation of magnesium or potassium levels. It can also be manipulated by some other antiarrhythmic medications or congenital long QT syndromes. The patient will experience dizziness, palpitation, lightheadedness as well, and they might have syncope or fainting, and if severe enough or prolonged, they can have cardiac arrest or death. To treat this condition, you need to accelerate the heart rate, as increasing the heart rate will essentially normalize the QRS distances. The best medication for this purpose is isoprotirenol, cardiac pacing, or atropine. So these are all the important notes about Torsets de Point. Our ECG course contains all the changes that can occur in an ECG, and it helps you become an ECG expert, so that you can recognize any ECG that you might come across. The course contains everything that might affect an ECG, all the symptoms, the causes, and of course the treatments. It also has plenty of quizzes to test your knowledge and make sure that you cement these information and be able to answer any question about an ECG. You can access the course using the link in the description or in the pinned comment.